I do know what that My means. Gosh. It means that January is around the corner mm. and it's back to being broke. Poverty is around the corner. Again. I you know. know right? I don't understand people who are so excited about December. Don't Guys, be. think about the future. After December, it's January. I mean, you only get 31 days of bliss, then it's going to be <laughs> 31 days of horror, poverty, oh water, gosh. slimming. Yeah, again. Month. Exactly. Christmas is gone. Now you have to start counting 360 something <laughs> days until you get Christmas again. That day when there's ultra mail in the fridge and custard at the same time. Do you know? Do you know that day where they just decide they're gonna buy custard and buy <laughs> ultra mail? The same so you have time. options. Do you have that? January, you January. won't even see the box. You won't. You won't. What today. is it? It's cold water, and that's when people start deciding they want to live a healthy life. Exactly. I mean, sitcoms are broke. I mean, <laughs> you won't find Carol <laughs> sipping orange juice. I mean, in January, she'll be sipping water and catching an apple exactly. going out. People start making life decisions. Now they want to be healthy. Life choices. I'm preparing uh-huh. for a summer body. Yeah, they want to lose weight. Hmm? They, they drink eight cups of water a day. But guess what? We know it's not the truth. We mm, see you. We I know. go by the name of Zanele. <laughs> I'm Nella and we are in Plainly Colorful. Wow. So it's been a great day. It's been a great day. It's been a I great have to day. Say. And well, we are just going to discuss a little about irritation. Irritation. You know what's irritating? GPS, directions, a friend who cannot give directions. Tell it cannot me get irritating it. like that. You know when you get into a taxi and you have to sit next to the taxi driver, not only middle <laughs> change, you <laughs> now have stress of directions. <laughs> you don't know where you're going. Oh my god, you remind me of one event, right? Mm-hmm. So this one time I'm on my way to my friend's um baby shower. But I don't know exactly where I'm going. But believe it or not, I'm walking to the taxis. And I'm thinking, what am I doing? Am I crazy? Exactly. Where am I even going? But no, I'm going there. You're going there. Some friends even have the nerve of sending you their location. And I'm like, "Um, do I own a car? I can't even use Google Maps. (laughs) Okay, wait, I can. But you just got to understand that sometimes it just, it's just not for everyone. It just doesn't work, you know, especially when you're on your feet and you're walking. I don't think that lady on maps is very um, patient enough to say in 300 meters, turn, turn right. right. <laughs> <laughs> I am walking. You know what she's going to say? In 300 meters, buy a car. Exactly. <laughs> Try finding a Volkswagen on the corner and exactly. make an inquiry, please. Exactly, because that's what happens. Or people who just call you and say, when you see this, turn left. Now I have to start looking at landmarks and, and people. Like, um, and they give you street names. And you know what, what, what the problem is with street names? They're not always there. They're not always so, there. So um, literally the pavement is dry. There's no name or whatsoever. And you're there like, I can't find any of this street. <laughs> <laughs> Which street again? <laughs> And you ask people there. Directions. And you ask people there. They're no longer giving you directions. They they now want your numbers because you're looking so good because you're going to an event. And they want to take you somewhere with them immediately. Oh my god, this just reminded me. Uh Uh-huh. I became a plus one at a wedding. What? That I didn't know. (laughs) I didn't plan it. Any crazy a plus one to a wedding and you don't even know anyone there. I didn't know I didn't even know this guy's second name. Actually for some reason I think he gave me a nickname. Wow. Oh my god. It's um it's called being forward issues. I get to be like that at times. I'm too forward for my own good. And let's say you had maybe superpowers. How would you tackle this issue? Directions and being a plus one to a wedding that you don't know. Um, first of all, I don't know. I don't know this guy's name. But on X Men, there's this guy that can kill you with his eyes. Right? He's uh-huh. always wearing glasses. Uh-huh. I know I would have done something to that guy's car. <laughs> I know I would have done something to that guy. That guy annoyed me. Honestly. 
I could just imagine you you're being introduced to the family. You don't even know the guy. You don't know the family. You he don't know the place. To the eldest people ever. The grands. This is my girlfriend. I'm like, we are? <laughs> really? When? How Do did we this speak happen? about this? <laughs> How we did this happen? Oh my gosh. Some people are annoying, <laughs> let alone irritating. Exactly. But you know what I wish I'd do? I'd freeze everyone, including him. <laughs> including him, I'd freeze all of them. Simply just take all the food. You know, Tapawe Nyana generally is around the corner, people. we saving here. <laughs> take a Tapawe. After the I just leave and then that's when. Okay, well, I don't know how they're going to unfreeze themselves. It's no longer my problem. You'll find a way. It's no, it's no longer my problem, way. okay, guys? I'm. Walking away, walking away from this terrible family. Oh my gosh, let's get into our first, first song. song. Okay, and our first song for our radio is Mabi Heaven and Views. So it took the pipes to bring you. How do you expect me to put you on a song when you've never been proud of who you've become? You told me the other day you don't fuck with regular niggas, but I'm fucking with a nigga who's a regular. Is it because I don't got a car to push start or a house in the boulevard? I'm just another nigga on the ground, so baby, please just play your part. Cause you know what's up. You and I just a star. I need the work of art. I need the keys to your heart. I'll be chilling with my heaven in view. Heaven in view. Heaven in view. I'll be chilling with my heaven in view. Heaven in view. Heaven in view. I'll be chilling with my heaven in view. Heaven in view. Heaven in view. I'll be chilling with my heaven in view. Heaven in view. Heaven in view. Uh, yeah, I heard them saying everybody favorite is vanilla How come vanilla get along better with chocolate? I think the problem is the dark is known for all sinners Everything strong and rigid, I know how to soften that Never will listen to dummy debates Never will miss cause I'm a chill out and come in you late All the seats up in the crib are only for the great I call them has been, go and clap Ricky Lake I get defensive when I'm missing all my heaven in view Anything other than that is a sickening view Off the comments and the rest of all them niggas in queue you holler, homie, as if I don't know what you do. I'm the plan and the proof, such a breeze for ya. I would probably get on one knee for ya. Memories for ya, no low key with ya. Really glad I never gave you all the group love. You know what's up? You know what's up? You know what's up? You and I just a star. I need the work of art. And welcome back to Painting Colorful. Elad was Mabi with Heaven in View, and I go by the name of Zanele. You can catch us on Twitter at LibingBe underscore Zen, or you can catch Plainly Colorful on YouTube at Saxoeto. But I'm not alone. I'm always with the most beautiful, the talented, the gorgeous. Oh my God, this can go on forever and mm. ever and <laughs> ever in fantasy land with Neo. <laughs> I am flirted. Thank you, Zane. Um, you can catch me on Instagram as Tladineo55, Twitter as Tladineo, and on Facebook as Neo Tladi. Welcome, guys. Welcome. And she just gave you everything. Like, literally everything. I had to. Now, Neo, have you ever got into a taxi or a bus and you were sitting next to the most gorgeous, the most handsome guy who just smells so mm. nice oh and gosh. looks so yeah. good and is so clean and is oh mm. so amazing you just described him really <laughs> um okay you're getting me off a bit okay now you're making me imagine him all over again but uh-huh. hey have you no quite a number of times mm. yes <laughs> right. quite a number right. of times did you tell the guy that you take him Honestly, in my head, yes, I told him and... I must have left that out. <laughs> of everything we spoke about. We didn't really do much of the speaking. Oh, right. <laughs> Listen, so the thing is, you see, we were in the front seat next to the driver. So <laughs> I was busy with change and... 
he didn't even help me. He just kept his glasses on and kept on looking gorgeous. But not that that's a problem. Keep no, on no. looking. Yes. I will tell you this. I'm disappointed of you. You are not a go-getter. I'm you can't be sitting with a yummy chunk in front of you, actually besides you, and not say, hold, hold, hold on to this money for me. I'm still counting the rest. He Meanwhile, could hold so many things. I almost <laughs> gave him my heart. But luckily, I didn't. But in my head, a lot of things went down. In my head, me and him got married and we have three kids. You did? One of them by the name of Zania. Like, honestly... In my head, the taxi stopped. Right. Mm -hmm. Stuck. He stuck on traffic. And he was getting so irritated. And then his phone was flat. And then he used my phone. Oh. Exactly. In my head. So, with that, he borrowed my phone. And I had airtime. Because I'm such a lady. And at airtime, and I borrowed him my phone. And after that, he put his cell numbers. Mm -hmm. He called me later. Told me he was home safe, asked if I was home safe, told me his name, and then he asked me out on a date. This is all in your head. Yes, this is all in my <laughs> head. This is all in my head. And and being me, I said yes. But you don't want to know, in real life, I was looking like a mess. I had a bad hair day oh, thanks no. to these winds. Like, oh, I had a gosh. bad hair day. So, I doubt he even looked in my direction. Oh, my but God. in my head, I was Haley Berry. I had that long uh, waving hair. I see. Exactly. I see. And I talked to him in a nice, calm voice like, Hi, I'm Zunele. <laughs> so, you don't know me now? You don't know, you me, know now. me later? <laughs> because i'm a go-getter right but here's the thing with us girls we forget that we are not everyone's types ladies yeah. oh, beautiful really? Really? or not curvaceous or not you are not every man's type That's so so as much as you look good and everything um yes he might look because you're there but that doesn't mean he's interested so I am rocking my petite body in the taxi. I'm mm. like, God, you go see me now. Today, you go see me. And mm. he's like, I'm like, um, excuse me. I want to sit here, right? Because he was sitting alone. And he's like, oh, okay, cool. No, I'm like, cool. So I pout. You know when you do that pout and you say, exactly. thank you. And you sit there like a diva. And you're waiting for him to say, Ooh, you smell good because I had that like one of my favorite perfumes and I was like today I take all of them all of them in my bag and that guy didn't say anything to me he didn't say anything he just didn't say anything to me I mean how could he how thing is we in our heads we think we this Haley Berry your Megan trainer your Beyonce the I thing was is, I was Haley Berry that day thing is we are all not Okay, this is like a practical scenario. There's a song by Beyonce, um, Diva. Mm -hmm. There's a scene where she throws a light at a car and there's this huge explosion and she's walking in her heels, exactly. looking all fierce. Listen, this is what happens That's what in real I imagined. life. This is what happens in real life. Throw the match, <laughs> your clothes are gonna burn off, that stiletto is gonna burn, you're gonna fall, you're gonna eat. The sand. Oh, no, no Beyonce situation. Yo, okay, guys, we should stop watching these movies. They, they should. Really they should write one us. of those "Don't try this at home" type of thing. Exactly. But in my head, after I got off that taxi that day, he was I imagined, I imagined he'd hold me as I leave the taxi. I, I imagined he'd hold my hand, right, and say, "I tried holding myself, but I couldn't." Mm. I want you. <laughs> <laughs> that was the main that was the main script I in my head. You. I exactly. want you girl. And I was like, I want you too. Oh, do you know like where you create these conversations in your head like he's gonna ask my name now? That's story, yeah. Um the I'm just script. gonna like, give him the snape. Exactly. You have this whole script. But when it actually comes to play, it doesn't really happen like sorry, could you please borrow me a phone? Yo. Uh uh, <laughs> at a time, or he or he says hello, instead of you saying hi, you're like yeah, bo. Exactly. Is it or you stumble on your words, hi, hello. I meant hey. Yeah, yeah. What? No, I meant what? No. Oh. Hey, leave me alone. What? He's what gone. 
Sorry, Dude. you lost the man of your dreams. It never <laughs> happens. You can it's even try it in Zulu. It won't sound sexy. You can't say, Saubon. Because it's going to be something though, else. That when we see these guys, we forget the main guys. Is it being unfaithful? I don't Honestly, temptation lurks around every corner. It doesn't, doesn't kill the look, does it? Okay, baby, if you're hearing this, <laughs> I'm not doing it. She said it. I am not I didn't say doing it. it. Baby, I was not part of this. I am <laughs> doing it, okay? I right, know. Let, let's be real, okay? <laughs> he does it. Okay, he does it with cars, <laughs> but it's, it's still looking. I don't feel as if it's a bad thing to look. It becomes really bad when you start creating all of these scenarios in your yeah. head. Well, he chooses Jim over me most of the time, so I know who the main chick is in this relationship. Jim. I don't know. So, why? Why are you angry? Why, once in a while, can I look at a bunch of muscles in a mall? I mean, you just described it's a, a free service. A guy <laughs> who's constantly in gym. I mean, like, that's our Tom Cruise. That's like our James Bond. We all want Christian Grey. A exactly. guy who goes to the gym, okay? Like, hey, Denzel. Like, hey, Denzel. <laughs> saying it right you're saying it in your head so it shouldn't be a biggie should it well uh, yeah it, it shouldn't but thing is it becomes frustrating when at the end of the day you're looking at him and he's not all of that and you yeah. just wish like you could just go to the gym and just sit there and say hey 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 i'm here i'm trying to fish for your attention and it's you're not looking at me you start getting all, all aggressive and dramatic in the gym Sorry, ma'am, we have to, um, uh, we're going to call security. Oh, my, oh, so now so you're now calling, you're calling security, security on me. Huh? Wow. You have so. guys with six packs. You don't call them security. They're the <laughs> I'm like skinny. I'm like really Are you skinny. calling security on I'm me? calling security on really? me. Is that, oh, is that the new South Africa? Hmm? Uh, really? Is that what democracy is causing? Really? I have had it with this world where the women can't have the freedom. But Newo, just be glad that you're not going to gym and gymming for his attention because believe me treadmills they do, they are not as easy as they look on tv i, I know I've true story shit. don't try lifting weights <laughs> it won't work okay <laughs> they will send you to the daycare center where kids are and they tell you to look after the kids because the treadmill the weights and all of that you can't look like tiana taylor exactly. who's in kanye west's I've music here. video oh, right. ariana grande ariana grande <laughs> okay you're gonna go out there my gosh, side to side. We're not side siding here. We're not, guys. We're not. Okay, guys. Um, well, l- well let's take a break. You know, yeah, like, should. honestly, think this about that hot. dream guy. Mm. And thinking about you actually doing something to get that dream guy you see in a taxi next to you. You know what? You're going to be lucky if he's short by 50 cents. Then you could just save <laughs> his life for Offer a couple of phone numbers. 50 cents. You'll exactly. be the girl of his dreams. Exactly. And now we're going to be um, playing action by Snow Beats. It's still pain fantasy. So it took the pulse to play you. Feels like my birthday 
But I wanna take it higher, give you all that you need Never need a supplier, never be a require All you do is inquire what I do Run to your everyone as I admire Take you to Maya, we see Mariah Life in Vegas, we'll explore the Atlas together Take the blind together, meet in the middle Be a seat as a kid, I got a riddle Tell me that you drunk Tell me where you at, I saw your thirst trap that you posted On your Instagram, I wanna be where you at I wanna take what you had, I wanna be what you have If you, that's what I could have Tell me everything you can when you look in my eyes Tell me you're a little drunk and need me there tonight Tell me you are the takes to blame it on the drunk takes In the morning voice, note yourself, morning time And that was action by Snow Beats. Guys, I hope you're having fun, huh? Mm-hmm. Cause we're having fun, hey? Exactly. Mm-hmm. It's very hot and steamy in here. So I was just asking her a question, but I'm like, no, 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 wait, you'll answer it on A. <laughs> so I'm going to ask it again. Zanele. Oh, gosh, yes. why am I even asking this? Have you ever taken a lift from a guy you don't know? No. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> no. We honestly, have a lie detector test in here. Like, she is lying. Honestly, no. I'll tell you the reason why. I watch so much CSI, Criminal Minds, NCIS. So every time I see a cute guy offering me a lift, I think of my body in a ditch. Yeah, okay. I think of myself being tortured because the great ones, the beautiful ones, the most handsome ones are, are the dangerous. most capable. I know. Exactly. Have you done it, Snow? What? Uh-huh. <laughs> Something we about that one. We didn't... We didn't say anything about asking me such a question on air but there's something about that what that say something mm. have you done it well l- look maybe once mm. once twice gosh three times what does it matter <laughs> okay i don't do it anymore you don't do it anymore look i got home safe thing is she was blessed with the gentlemen yes they still exist they do exist okay mm-hmm. but it's pretty rare to find them because I use the bus and sometimes I don't have a seat and these guys are just going to be sitting down while I'm standing. Don't even like, offer you a seat. Like, mm-hmm, don't, don't you want to offer me a seat or something? You need to, no, girl, you need to get your booty in front of his, eye, his eyes, like right really? next to him. Like, like, he goes, excuse me. And you're like, oh, I'm sorry. Um, what? What, what, do, what? What are you saying? It's fine. You can sit. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Exactly. Like, it hardly ever happens. Like, it never happens. 
Guys don't offer seats anymore. Well, only the good guys do. But why am I never in a bus with a good guy? Exactly. That's the question. I keep saying that the day I have a son, he will know all these things. I will tell him, boy, stand up, let your mommy sit. Let your mommy sit. And let that's the good feet. foundation. That's where my son's going to know that, oh, right. So when a woman can't and you have a seat and there's no other seat, let, let her sit. sit. Exactly. Okay. Like, sorry, like, I can't just say, like, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to faint? Honestly, we can, exactly. I can be dramatic. <laughs> exactly. I, I can put it off. My gosh, character is my name. I can just go there and say, <gasps> boom, <sighs> down. I will faint and I will get two seats and I'll wake up on my bus stop. <laughs> I don't even oh want your God. water. <laughs> You will wake up immediately when you get to your bus stop, and then they're like, "Wait, we, we're going to the we're going to the hospital." Like what? Hospital for what? No. As soon as I see my bus stop, I, I'm I'm waking up. I'm taking my bag and I am oh leaving. Leaving. Yeah, you got school to go to. Hey, it, it, you, you're dude. not trying to be sitting in the bus the whole day, are you? <laughs> What's going on? But honestly, I wish I had superpowers. You know, I'd actually make. An empty bus come to me, just like draw an empty bus. You know, I have mermaid eyes. They say that mermaid eyes like draw attention to people and yeah. you can make them do whatever you want. I wish I had those eyes, okay? Bus drivers would come to me with an empty bus and it'd be the only one sitting, okay? I'm tired of these school kids and exactly. people coming in and hugging all in on my... yourself. Exactly. <laughs> if I had special powers, I would choose to have one of those wind or whatever thing they call... Um, those sticks they have in Harry Potter. Yeah, you the know, wands have that spell that just removes somebody off their seat. So yeah. as I walk in <laughs> with that dramatic walk, I go, <laughs> the person's off their seat. I sit down, done. Imagine how no that would No one's fighting look. anyone. I want the sound effects. Dude, like, this is not Harry Potter. I want the sound effects. Like, yo! <laughs> 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 What's uh, like I, 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 I just want to see that. Plus it, is, plus it will sound quick. Like when you when they move from their chair, it's gonna be like, and then they da- and they're on yeah. the floor. You and won't the understand. Like, go, 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 go. You know how everyone's always like, uh, but they don't help. <laughs> <laughs> no one ever helps. They say sorry, or they look at you, Actually, or they continue no, with they their take business. a video of you. Ah, guys, I'm dying here. And they're like, wait. Ooh. Wait, can we get wait. that part again? Wait. Where you scream. Wait, scream again. Humanity, where did it go, guys? I don't know. Smartphones took it, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Smartphones, YouTube, everything else. It just went My away. My life depends on that. it. If I don't take a video, I'm going to be out. Exactly. I'm, exactly. I'm not going to fit in anymore. Oh. Uh, difficult life well think about this tell us what would you do if you had all of these superpowers and you were in a cramped bus which powers did you wish you had did you wish you were superman you wanted to fly or do you wish you just that you had like super speed you could just run home five minutes ten minutes and you're already home but why do you think of that let us play a song by music messengers featuring my p titled what kind of life is this beautiful what ki- song beautiful like song. It's, it's, a, it's a good song. What kind of life is this way? Boys don't even give up seats anymore. Okay, guys. What kind of life is this, guys? There you go. La, 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 la. Tell me if 
What kind of life is this by Music Messengers featuring Mapi? What a beautiful song, guys. What a beautiful song. We're back on our last segment of the show. How sad. Uh, don't want to get away from this mic, but hey, <laughs> you have to move on in life, I guess. Move on in life. But you know what the good news is? People can listen and watch this show over and over and again, over right? yeah. again because it's on our YouTube channel. Exactly. Actually, I'm gonna listen. Over, I'm gonna listen to it over and over again. Over and over again at our YouTube channel at Psych Soweto. Mm, can't mm. wait. Can't wait. But anyway, guys, you know, we're just we're just talking about this, right? That in the morning, on your way to work, is a nightmare. True. Traffic. True. Well, you're lucky if you're in a taxi. Those people don't give up about traffic. They go way beyond out of their way to make sure you get to work early. Unless if their money is short of two rands, of course. Then you're just going to stand there for hours. <laughs> <laughs> the driver wants his two rands. But anyway, if you're in a car, it's a mess. It kind of is because at the end, I mean, taxi drivers are well. Taxi drivers and they drive well. Like taxi drivers, yeah. which is well. Reckless, they're going to pull up in front of you, overtake you. So you really have to be careful when you're stuck in traffic with a car. Yeah, just be careful and just make sure you follow the rules of the road if that still applies. But of course, we have superpowers. Of course we do. Right? That is why we're so colorful in this plain day. So here's me. I'm, 
I'm a bit violent, I know, guys. And I, I, I know that you're listening to me and you're like, she's going to come up with a very violent solution. Why not? The world is aggressive. But I want to be Dr. Octavius from Spider-Man 2. Mm-hmm. I want to take those steel things behind me <laughs> and just separate all those cars and go like side to side create a pathway exactly where i can drive alone and listen to music see simple as that how everyone else gets to work well is none of my business well on the other hand if i if it was me i'd actually make a storm but that would actually lead to me being unemployed because you might as well destroy my building (laughs) so if i were to be stuck in traffic and I'm running late and I have the meanest boss in the world, what would I do? Honestly, I wish I was Superman at this point. I wouldn't even drive. I'd just fly, okay? Right. I'd fly. That would be awesome. These birds better not cause any traffic, okay? I have heat vision. <laughs> they better watch out. They don't want to be meat masala or something. They don't want to be flying next to you, girl. They, no one wants to be flying next to me when I'm late. 10 minutes late <laughs> to work, okay? Do you know what that gets me? Exactly. A boss who's going to get in your throat. Exactly. And Cough we that person all out. do not. Speaking about bosses, do you ever have that moment where you wish you could just tell them off, like, just yeah. be the boss for the day instead of them saying, you're late. You well, didn't tell anyone you're late. Well, here's you. Here's you when he's like, you're late. You're like, sorry, sir. It won't happen again. But in your head, you're like, yeah, right, jerk. You come to work when you want to. Do everything you want to do. Why can't I do that? Honestly, Moron. In my head, I wait for him to get to the door. As soon as he gets to the door, I'm like, wait, I ain't done yet. I'm going to come late for as long as I want to. <laughs> you can't find me because I do my work very well. You would know because you're so incompetent. And then I'd just walk out with my heels and strut around and he'd say, yes, ma'am, here's a promotion. Wow. Is that superpowers? Because that's on the next level. <laughs> that is on like the next level of what I wish I would do. It's been a beautiful show, guys. It's been, it's been awesome quite a beautiful show. show. We have to be out of here. Yes, but do remember, do not try this at work. Cooking or ironing because you'll burn clothes, you'll burn the food, or you'll get fired at work for daydreaming. Yeah, don't don't listen to us, guys. Don't, don't. listen Listen to us, but don't listen to us. Listen to us, don't listen to us, listen to us, but don't actually apply listen it because you still want your job. <laughs> and we are closing this show off. Remember, you can catch us on our YouTube channel, Psych Soweto. You can catch me, Zane, on Twitter at Libimbi underscore Zane and on Instagram at Zanygram Libimbi, but I'm not always alone. You can also catch Neo at Instagram at StudyNeo55. Twitter handle is TladiNeo4 and Facebook is Neo Tladi. Remember to keep your fantasy running, but don't you ever apply it. This is plainly colorful. Thank you guys, it's been awesome. We're gonna leave you guys with a song. Yes, we're gonna leave you with Guru Logic Run Fast. If you're running, you're not running fast enough. <laughs> Run Fast by Guru Logic. Bye guys. Have yourselves a lovely day. So it's a club house. Your dream is that thing that sets you apart If you have a dream that you believe A vision that you see for your life Write it down, water it well and watch it grow Chase that dream, chase it hard Like a dog to a bone Baby, all you gotta do is make sure that you run And you run fast Run fast Don't wait for no one to believe in you Don't wait for them either to affirm you You need to dream wide awake Dream fast asleep All you gotta do is chase your dream And make sure that you run and you run fast
Club House Radio.